Graduation is a big day, so you're gonna need a big cake, and this one is the perfect mix of fun and formal. This is a four-tier graduation cake, uh, three tiers being the festive part and the top being graduation cap. Each of the tiers are two layers, and then I added a coat of buttercream to them and then covered them with fondant. The bottom tier has stripes and twists, so even though this is a traditional cake, it has some formal elements and some fun elements. I wanted all of the strips and the twists to, to have the same thickness, so I got my pasta roller out. I just roll my fondant out kind of thin and then roll it through that, and it's real slick. So I made the twist the same way um, that I did the stripes and then I cut them into a strip, held it at the top, and then twisted it before I adhered it at the bottom. So there is a silhouette of the graduate in the middle as the centerpiece. I found a silhouette image on the internet, printed it out, cut it out, and then rolled out gum paste and then just traced around it with my X-Acto knife. And then I sprayed it black so it would be a nice silhouette against the white layer. I used the numbers out of gum paste also, so they would hold their shape. And then I used my airbrush with a little golden brown, and then I went in and sprayed them with gold. Every graduation cake has to have a graduation cap on it, so I put that um, on the top. The bottom part um, was just a domed uh, double layer cake covered with fondant, and then I actually just used a square cake board and covered that with fondant. Another handy tool that I have is a little fondant extruder, and uh, I filled that with red fondant and made the cords for the tassel. Very important for a graduation is the diploma. So I used gum paste for that as well. I uh, rolled out a square and rolled it up just like a real diploma would be. I added some finishing touches of the stars just to give it some pop and some wow and just some celebratory accents on it. And then I just finish off all of the, the tiers with the bead border. This design would be able to be personalized really easily with school colors that you choose, or if you wanted a different silhouette, you know, maybe if somebody was in sports, you know, with a hockey stick or something, or a basketball, or, you know, a stack of books. So you could change out the silhouette and it would be a really cool design. Congratulations, graduates of 2020.